Hello, this is uh, Jeremy Edsel, and this is the second part of my making a paper mache skull. In this uh, segment, we'll be working on building the skull. We've already worked on the uh, jawbone, as you see here. And what we're doing is working on the top of the jaw, the uh, top of the teeth, and the uh, top portion of the skull. Uh, we do that by taking a piece of cardboard, wrapping it up in aluminum foil, and folding it over several times. And you'll see how that gets folded and molded. And that becomes part of the uh, face of the skull. And you test fit it into the jawbone. And then what you want to do is depress the center to make a little bit of a cavity for where the nose is and that will become apparent here in a minute and you see there's a little bit of a sculpture there and then uh, with that indentation you can start filling in with paper mache and start building that nose portion of the skull and there it is covered with paper mache takes on a rounded appearance and then you can add some teeth as well by doing the uh, tips of the uh, popsicle sticks. And again you want to test fit it to make sure it fits that uh, jawbone. Then you want to get a couple tops to some uh, plastic soda bottles and what you do with these is cover these with aluminum foil as well as you see here. And then press these into the sides of that front of the skull and fill these in with paper mache. Start building around them as you see here. Continue to build and cover. There will be a hole there in the middle, and we'll see what we'll do with that in a minute. Um, what you want to do is make a ball of paper, newspaper, kind of like a brain size, and that kind of looks like a brain stem because you want to leave a, a little piece coming down. Insert that in that hole, push it down, turn it over, and attach it to the back of the um, that top tube portion and cover it over with paper mache. And then start filling around the whole um, part of that, uh, what I call the brain portion. And then continue to cover and then what you want to do is take another piece of aluminum foil, make a long piece and wrap that around and kind of uh, contour it in around those eye sockets. And then you can start covering that with paper mache as well. And then you just want to work around the entire skull portion, covering all those places in, covering up all that aluminum foil, and just building the top of that skull. Uh, most of these in these two first two videos were all done in uh, one time period, so you should be able to complete almost the whole project within that one time period. And then uh, our next segment will be when I took a break and we'll come back and finish and do some details. Thanks for watching, and uh, be sure to visit the website for more information at uh, haycrosshollow.com. Check me out on MySpace at Studio Haycross, or you can email me at studiohaycross at hotmail.com. Thanks for watching.